In this video, you will use FortiGate Web Filtering to apply safe search to all Google results and also block access to websites in the Adult Mature Content FortiGuard category. In order to block encrypted traffic, you will either use full SSL inspection or change your network's DNS settings. By doing this, you can make sure that unsuitable content is blocked for all users on your network, even Google search results. This recipe requires an active FortiGuard web filtering license. Before you begin, make sure web filtering is enabled by going to System, Config, Features. Next, go to Security Profiles, Web Filter, and edit the default profile so that adult content is blocked. Enable FortiGuard categories. Select the Adult Mature Content category and set it to Block. Finally, select Enable Safe Search and Search Engine Safe Search. Go to Policy and Objects, Policy, IPv4, and edit the policy that allows connections from the internal network to the Internet. Under Security Profiles, Enable Web Filter and set it to use the default profile. The Web Filter profile will now be applied to your network's traffic. However, because Google Search often uses HTTPS traffic, web filtering alone may not be able to block all adult content. There are two methods that can be used to enforce Google Safe Search for all traffic. Using full SSL inspection so that encrypted traffic is fully inspected, or changing the DNS records to send search traffic to forcesafesearch.google.com. Using the full SSL inspection method, your FortiGate decrypts, examines, and then re-encrypts HTTPS traffic to apply security scanning. Using full inspection may cause certificate errors. For information about avoiding these, check out the recipe preventing certificate warnings. Go to Policy and Objects, Policy, IPv4, and edit the policy that allows connections from the internal network to the Internet. Set SSL slash SSH inspection to use the deep inspection profile. Full SSL inspection will now be applied to Internet traffic. Using the DNS records method, your FortiGate intercepts all DNS queries for Google Search and sends traffic to the website forcesafesearch.google.com. The configuration for this method varies depending on whether your FortiGate is the DNS server for your network or if an external DNS server is used. In this video, a FortiGate using an external DNS server is shown, with notes about how the configuration would differ if the FortiGate was an internal DNS server. More information on the internal DNS server configuration is also available in the recipe Blocking Adult Mature Content with Google Safe Search. Go to System, Config, Features, and select Show More. Make sure that DNS database is on. If necessary, apply your changes. Go to System, Network, Interfaces, and create an interface to be used for the FortiGate DNS service. Set Type to Loopback Interface and assign an IP network mask. Go to System, Dashboard, Status, and enter the following command into the CLI console to create a recursive DNS server. Go to System, Network, DNS Servers. The new server is listed under DNS Service on Interface. If your FortiGate is a network's DNS server, the DNS server would be associated with your internal network's interface, and a loopback interface would not be required. Create a new entry in the DNS database. Set DNS Zone as Google, domain name to google.com, and disable authoritative. Create a new DNS entry. Set type to address A, set host name to www, and IP address to the IP address of forcesafesearch.google.com. If required, create additional DNS database entries for other Google search domains, such as www.google.ca. 
A list of Google search domains can be found here. If your FortiGate is the network's DNS server, the configuration is now complete. However, the following steps are required for an external DNS configuration. Go to System Dashboard Status and enter the following command into the CLI console to create a new virtual IP. Set source filter to the IP range of your internal users. External interface to your internal interface and mapped IP to the IP address of the loopback interface. Go to Policy and Objects, Policy, IPv4, and create a policy to use the virtual IP to intercept DNS queries. Set the incoming interface to your internal interface, the outgoing interface to the loopback interface, Destination address to the virtual IP and service to DNS. Make sure NAT is disabled. Make sure that the new policy is located above the policy that allows connections from the internal network to the Internet. The results differ depending on which method you use to enforce safe search. If you use full SSL inspection, go to google.com and attempt to search for adult content. When the results are shown, a message appears stating that safe search is turned on. This cannot be undone. If you alter the DNS settings, when you go to google.com, a message appears stating that your network has turned on safe search. Thank you for watching. For further details, you can go to docs.fortnet.com to access our complete documentation library. You can also go to the cookbook site at cookbook.fortnet.com for more tutorials like this one.